Hello, everybody, and welcome to another video. So today we're going to be talking about Avengers because not only has the release date been leaked for the new update with Winter Soldier, but a bunch of other details have as well because somebody didn't listen to the embargo rules. So, uh, <laughs> yeah, if you don't know what an embargo is, it basically um, this person was given early access to information by Square Enix and the Avengers game team. And in return, they were going to cover the game. And uh, they released this information earlier than they were supposed to. So here, first off, we have our image of Winter Soldier right here. You can also see MODOK and what looks like cloning labs in this actual star. But other than that, we also have a bunch of other information that I have listed here. Oh. But here we have, first off, cloning labs, as seen in the No Rest for the Wicked Warzone, Monica has revived Modok, but was unable to bring him under her control. The monstrous genius has now taken over Ames' cloning lab. Ames' most precious base and the source of the clone villains that have plagued the Avengers. From there, Modok intends to take back up his crusade against powered individuals, and you must stop him once and for all before you can put his plans into action. This Omega level threat is a new end game challenge headlined by a climactic confrontation with the deranged genius to end the danger once and for all. The lab is a challenging aim base that players will navigate before facing off one last time against Modok in a grand multiplayer fight. Modok has developed new tactics since players confronted him in San Francisco and is designed to test our heroes in this four against one fight. As an uh, Omega level threat, Cloning Labs is designed to push out a team of four high level heroes, though it will be similar accessible length to our previous Omega level threats. Family Reunion Cloning Lab requires power level 175 to enter. We'll reward both new gear and higher level gear than ever before with the power level cap increasing to 185. Uh, Scott Porter will be voicing Winter Soldier and he has escaped captivity and rejoined his friend and allies. Scott is well known from Friday Night Lights, Heart of Dixie, Ultimate, blah, blah, blah. Uh, he also voiced Bucky from Lego Marvel's Avengers. Um, we can't wait for you to see his tank on the Winter Soldier. And you'll first hear his work in our upcoming Winter Soldier motion comic. So I'm assuming that'll be the similar to the lady female uh, Mighty Thor. The product of a Soviet black science program, the Winter Soldier emerged as a master assassin. He adds to the roster an almost purely assault-focused hero focused on dealing damage to his enemies in a variety of ways. Players will find multiple different builds and playstyles to embody that character fantasy, from the ranged marksman to an expert hand-to-hand -hand combatant to the deadly super soldier. While echoes of Bucky's past training partners like Captain America and Black Widow can be seen in some of his moveset, Basically, this is saying that he is a partial Echo, but just a little bit. Uh, he has made them his own and combined them with skills from of his own with cybernetic enhancements. Players will find all new animations, a new full skill tree, and heroic abilities all his own when they enter a mission as the Winter Soldier. Now, this is basically them saying it's not an Echo. Don't worry, it's got new animations and stuff because people didn't like the last hero. Winter Soldier, Winter Soldier, Winter Soldier will also launch with his own heroic mission chain, sees the Avengers help him regain his confidence in his capacity for good and deal with the trauma inflicted on him by his captors. Players that complete the mission chain will be rewarded with Bucky's iconic outfit. Beyond 2.7, our next update past 2.7 will continue with the ongoing revisions and tuning to heroes that we started in 2.6 and continue into 2.7. This ongoing process to continually ensure that each and every hero feels good. Uh, I don't know. I accidentally cut this off. But yeah, that's basically it. All of this info was leaked by another YouTuber. Um, I'll add their link to the description. But yeah, there we go. Also, while we're here on Twitter, just got to say, uh, wait, where do I? Hold on. I'm stupid. I'm bad at Twitter on PC. 
uh, you can follow me here. And uh, there we go. That's it. Guess what? You made it to the end of the video. Before leaving, give it a like if you enjoyed, and consider subscribing for more content like this. You can also find me on Twitter and Twitch via the link in the description. Have any questions or feedback on the video? Comment them below. You still here? If you are, check out this playlist, or maybe this video. You know, whichever you prefer, or if you don't want to do that, maybe click that subscribe button. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.